really nice. St. James's Park, nice. So the country might have gone to ruin by then. That was a thing. Some historical landmark or something like that. I'm at West Westminster Tube Station. Let's go to the next stop. No, I'm not getting distracted by Greg's. I am not happy. I need my coffee. Next train in three minutes. Anyway, of course, I'm going to get interrupted. It wouldn't be a me video if I didn't get interrupted, would it? The cost on the other platform gets to be open, doesn't it? Not fair. This station feels modern and airy and has a distinct Jubilee line feel. Now, since this is also a Jubilee line station, I'm going to hazard a guess that this was refreshed when the Jubilee line extension opened. Just hazarding a guess. I don't know what gives it away. Could it just be that late 90s feel? It's very distinct. More stairs. The stairs never end. Very noisy here at Embankment. I mean, that's a recurring pattern with all of these central London stations. Um, it is naturally right on the embankment. I can see a river. That means I need to go and explore the river and maybe walk to the next station. We'll see how this goes. I mean, could this view be any more London? So I'm walking down the embankment to Temple Station. It's not very pleasant down here. I know people like romanticize the Thames, but the problem is mankind has ruined it with cars. Yes, mankind has ruined a river by lining it with cars everywhere. Anyway, Temple Station shouldn't be too far away. I am going to enjoy the view though. Are we nearly there yet? What? Stations remaining. Temple, Blackfriars and Mansion House. Well, I'm going to end this episode and then start filming the next one immediately. Because multitasking One thing I didn't check was, where even is Temple Station? I think I need to be on the other side of the road. People look at you funny when you just cross roads in London. I'm not going to wait for green. I'll be here forever in this city. Anyway, we must be closed by now. Currently at Temple, Blackfriars, then Mansion House, and then we're done for this video. I just need the train. That one's noisy. Line train to Upminster. The next station is Blackfriars. I have a question. At Blackfriars, why are the up escalators on the right hand side? I'm sure they're normally on the left.
behind me is Blackfriars Station and over there is Blackfriars Bridge but I'm not going to go to the river again I've already done it in this video and my legs are starting to ache so I'm going back in and I'm going to get the next train to where we're finishing for the day not for the day, for the video I'm carrying on I mean I could go and check out St Paul's Cathedral but I'm not that into it to be honest I'd rather look at tube stations let's go of course it has a prep but you're not going to get me going to prep never in a million years I'm assuming that Blackwise has had a recent refurb because it's all airy and modern Train. loving the like 3D roundels that they have here. They're cute. I like it. I do also like the uh, green and yellow tiling up there. Just a little nice touch, obviously for the district and circle lines. Mansion House does have an abandoned platform. I like abandoned things. Uh, it used to be used to terminate eastbound trains here, but the ones that need to terminate go a little bit further to, I think it's Tower Hill. Don't quote me on that. Maybe quote me on that. I don't know. Ask a London expert, and that's not me. Speaking of noise, here's another train. So, that was Mansion House. But I'm now at Cannon Street. Why am I at Cannon Street? Because I'm carrying on filming. I'm filming the next episode already. So, watch this space at Cannon Street onwards for now. Thank you for joining me on this journey from Gloucester Road all the way to Mansion House, which is just over there. Like, the distance between these two stations is like so small, it's even, it's, it's just tiny. But yeah, thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all the things that kids say. If you want to support me on Patreon, I'd absolutely love it if you'd do that. It helps me do videos like this all the way down here from Manchester. For now, I've got an intro to film and I'll see you guys in the next video.